Namaste everyone. Today in this video I am going to discuss about class 12 compulsory English first section that is language development section and our grammar topic in unit 1 question tag. So I am going to discuss about question tag here. Tag question. My name is Jeep Chalise. It is me here. In this session, uh, we are going to discuss about the tag questions, general rules and what is tag questions we are discussing about this one. So, question tags are the third questions that we put at the end of the sentence. Particularly in a spoken English, we use tag question. We use question tag to make confirmation, right. So, uh, here there are some basic rules of question tags. For example, in question tag only pronouns are used. Okay, we are not using the noun. For example, David has got a car. So, we use does not he, not does not David. Similarly, look at here, we use contracted form of not. We do not use an OT, rather we use an apostrophe T not in question tag. Look at the example, you live near here. So, do not you, it is not, do not. Okay. If the main part of the sentence is positive, the tag is negative and vice versa. If the statement is negative, the tag will be positive. For example, he is a doctor, is not he or you work in a bank, do not you. Okay. If the main part of the sentence is negative, the question tag is positive. Okay. For example, you have not met him, have you. She is not coming, the tag is, is she. Now, the question tag uses the same verb as the main part of the sentence. If the main part of a sentence contains an auxiliary verb, the same auxiliary verb will be used for making question tag. Okay. If the auxiliary verb is have or be, does not make difference, we use the same auxiliary verb. For example, they have gone away for a few days. The question tag is have not they. The have uh, here is used as, auxiliary, as an auxiliary verb. Look at another example, they were not here, the tag is where they. So, where is a be verb, right, it is a past form of be verb. Next example, he had met him before, so had is a auxiliary verb here, had not he. Now, if the main part of the sentence does not have an auxiliary verb, the question tag uses an appropriate form of do verb do and does in simple present or in present form and did in the past form of tense. Example, I said that, said is the past form of say, so the tag is did not I. So, you do not recognize me, it, the do verb itself is uh, uh, main verb here, so we have to extract do itself and the statement is negative, we have to make a positive tag to you. She eats meat, so does not see. Okay. When there is have as a main verb, it can both take have and do in question tag depending on the situation. Okay. If the have means possession, he has a car, you can make has not he or does not he or it takes only do in question tag if the have means take. For example, Sita has her meal at 12 here. Sita takes her meal at 12. That is why the tag is does not see. Furthermore, if there is a modal verb will, shall, can, could, etc. in the main part of the sentence, the question tag uses the same modal verb. For example, they could not hear me, could they? Okay. You would not tell anyone, it is a negative sentence, will you? Because here this will you is positive form of won't here and it is a modal verb. Be careful with the question tag with sentences that start I am or I am. The question tag for I am is are not I and I am not is am I. For example, I am the fastest. So, the question tag will be are not I, not am not I. So, I am not a teacher. So, it is a negative sentence but when you make the uh, question tag for negative sentence starting with I am, it becomes am I. The statements containing the subject like someone, somebody, nobody, anyone, no one or none or everybody or everyone etc. We, we use they as their pronoun in question tag. Although they take singular subject in subject verb agreement, 
So, uh, these uh, subject they take the singular, uh, singular verb in subject verb agreement right, but in uh, question tag we generally we use they as their pronoun. For example, everybody has come. So, even though there is verb has we have to make haven't they. Okay, uh, the subject everybody takes singular verb in subject verb agreement but in question tag we use they as its pronoun. So, we should use plural verb in question tag and the example have is used in the question tag not has. The statement containing the subject like something, nothing, everything, anything etcetera we use it as their pronoun in question tag. For example, something is lost. So, question tag is is not it. Okay. If statements contain the words like nothing, no one, none, hardly, rarely, never, barely. So, they are uh, treated as negative sentences and we use positive tag. For example, she has never been to Kathmandu. The tag will be has she. With imperative sentences, we use will you in question track. For example, open your book, will you. So, this sentence starts from verb, direct verb. So, it is an imperative sentence, we, we use will you. Okay. Sila, there is comma, go to your class, it is a command. So, even though there is name Sila, so it is a command. So, the tag will be will you, do not make noise still will you. So, even though this is a negative sentence, so it is an imperative sentence and we have to make the tag will you. Let me do the task alone. So, again will you. Here I will make more clarify on uh, let and let us. Okay. We use the question tag shall we with the sentence starting let us. For example, let us go. So, it becomes shall we. So, it is uh, here let us means let us go together, but look at here we use question tag will you for let us for example, let us play outside this means you are asking permission. So, question tag will be will you. Okay. D rather means would rather and D better means had better. So, you have to understand this one if there is apostrophe D for example, you would rather go home. So, here would not you but a d better means you would better leave the room now means had not you. So, in the second sentence here the apostrophe d means had. So, with the subject all we can use the pronoun it or they depending on the situation. For example, all is well is not it here all is singular and its pronoun is it. All are well. So, we have to make are not they here all is plural and its pronoun is they. Okay. Exercises from textbook. So, we, we are here in the uh, second part that is uh, exercises from your textbook. Uh, number A is just an example for you. Uh, Let us go to number B. Uh, rewrite the following sentences adding appropriate question tag at number A. Uh, Gil does not know and. So, here uh, this is a negative sentence you have to make a positive tag. So, does he. does he. Okay. Uh, number B, I am very patient. Uh, it is starting from I am. So, the tag will be aren't I. Aren't I. Okay. <coughs> Question mark. Uh, number C, they apostrophe did. That never met me before. So, it is uh, uh, met is V3. Uh, so, it is had. It is not would. It is definitely it's had. So, the tag will be had they. Had they, right. Number D, listen carefully. Imperative sentence starting from verb. So, listen carefully. It's will you. Okay. Number E, let's have a break. So, it's let's means here together. So, uh, the tag will be shall we. Shall we. Okay. Number F, uh, let us invite them. So, let us means you are asking permission, right? So, uh, sir, will you? 
will you okay number g hurry used to live in france as a boy by a past tense used to pass so the uh, tag will be didn't he didn't he number eight you'd better not take a hard drink so if there is a better after the apostrophe d so it's a hard better if there is rather after apostrophe d becomes would rather okay so this is had here so the tag will be had you had you because the sentence is negative you have to make positive tag number i sip it grass so sip here is a plural noun uh, so the tag will be the pronoun will be they so it's a positive sentence uh, you have to make a negative tab that's don't they right mr pandey can speak nine languages so it's a modal verb here can so you have you can use the same modal verb can and so this is can I speak a positive sentence you have to make a negative tab can't panda is mr panda so it's uh, he can't he right number k c apostrophe finished her classes so finished is v3 so this is definitely has so it's hasn't hasn't c uh, number l c barely managed to reach the goal here the word barely makes this sentence negative it gives a negative sense then you have to make positive tag tag will be did c managed to speak uh, it's a past tense so it's did c uh, let's go to question number m don't let him swim in the pond so it's will you simple and number n there are lots of people here so the sentence that start from there the tag you have to uh, you in the tag you have to use there as pronoun itself so uh, aren't there aren't there right so in this way we have to uh, make a question tag uh, question number c read the following situation what do you say in this situation use question tag so you have to have your say in the given situation the situations are there and you have to complete the sentence there and you have to make tag of your completed sentence the sentence that you have made right uh, question number a the sky is full of cloud you can see lightning and hear thunder so it's going to rain it's already given there so you don't need to uh, make anything here the, it's given there even though there is comma so you can omit that one say here isn't it isn't it question number b you want to pay the taxi fare but you are short by 100 rupees sam you have to lend me 100 rupees here in this sentence there is have to if there is have to has to or had to we have to extract the do verb so here the tag is it's a positive sentence negative tab uh, okay let's make it don't you number c you have met a stranger at a party and you want to have a chat with him or her so what you can say you can say like we can be a friend or we can dance together so i have made here we can dance together then uh, can't we okay uh, number e you came out of the film hall with your friend and you enjoyed the film so you have to complete the sentence the film was very entertaining because you enjoyed it so the film is very entertaining the tag is wasn't wasn't so film is it right Number E, you and your friend listened to a comedian on the stage and felt spellbound by his or her performance. So he gave an excellent performance. The tag is, didn't he? 
didn't he right number f you think your friend's father has arrived from the us but you are not sure so the statement is your father has not arrived from the us has he right uh, number g you think susan will join the new job tomorrow but you are not sure so you have to confirm okay susan will join office from tomorrow so uh, there is a model verb will the tag will be won't he won't he uh, susan can be both uh, boy or girl so it doesn't matter your friends here look looks too short the statement is you have got two shirt here the tag is haven't you haven't you uh, number i you want to go for a picnic with your friends in class so the sentence is starting from let's let's go for a picnic shall we number j you want permission from your father to go for a walk so you ask permission let me go for a morning walk then it's a permission so the tag is will you so in this way you have to uh, do the question tag i hope you have uh, understood uh, thank you so much and if any you have any questions or any feedback you can write me an email thank you